to link up with Mozambique Railways and Lorenzo Marx, Rhodesia Railways are extending their system 200 miles beyond Bannock Burns. They have evolved a track laying system that saves time and labor. At the depot, the lines and ties are assembled to form a complete unit 40 feet long. They're bolted down, and when they're absolutely rigid and secure, they're ready for hoisting and loading onto flat cars to be transported to the laying site. Six sections are loaded one on top of another, separated by small wheels that will allow them to slide when wanted. In this way, with 80 yards of line to a flat car and 11 flat cars to a train, half a mile of assembled line is sent forward at a time. At the end of the line is a laying crane onto which the rails are slid. This ingenious affair lifts the top rail from the pile, hoists it out, and then travels forward over the last rails it has laid. Now the whole section is added to the line complete in very much the same way as the lines are assembled for a kid's model train. So the line is pushed ahead by 40 feet leaps and bounds. And even in the final placing, the manhandling is reduced to a minimum. Both them together and voila, it's simplicity itself, but not to some people. This method is so fast that the link-up should be operating next year. The final stage is of course the ballasting. Over 50 miles of the 200 required are already complete. It may be speeded up even further, but at this rate of progress, by 1955, Rhodesia will have its vital rail link with Lorenzo Marx.